tech enthusiast welcome back to the channel we got a good video for you today I did have the channel up and running a few months ago when I first purchased this MacBook so I didn't have a chance to do an initial review and with tax return season right around the corner I thought I'd do a video letting you guys know my thoughts on the M2 MacBook Air after getting a chance to use it for a few months now and a couple of thoughts on why you should consider getting one with a little bit of that tax return money before we get started go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button to help me get the channel off the ground all the love you guys have shown so far has been greatly appreciated and it has inspired me to keep growing and keep improving the content. First, let's talk about some of the specs of the M2 MacBook Air. This is the absolute base level of the MacBook Air and the least expensive with 8 gigabytes of RAM and 256 gigabytes of storage. This is the laptop for those of you who are looking to introduce yourself to the Mac experience for the first time or some of you that have an older MacBook that it might be time to upgrade. It boasts an impressive 18 hours of battery life that lets you stay productive all day without recharging. This laptop features the new M2 chip with an upgraded version of the M1 chip found in the previous generations of MacBook Air. The M2 chip provides faster performance and improved energy efficiency, so you can expect faster app launches and smoother multitasking. The M2 chip starts the next generation of Apple Silicon with even more speed and power than that of the M1. Apple claims it's up to 1.4 times faster than the M1 model and 15 times faster than that of the Intel base models. So you can expect to get more completed in faster times with a more powerful 8-core CPU, while you can keep working or playing all day and into the night with a great battery life. On multiple occasions with some of those lighter work days, I've gone days without having to plug my MacBook in. But when you do, the addition of the MagSafe charger will give you quicker charge times at up to 67 watts, as well as give you another freed up USB-C port. And thanks to the optimized efficiency of the M2 chip, this MacBook can deliver amazing performance without a fan and rarely have to throttle back. I've seen a lot of reviews that claim the 8 gig memory model isn't good for anything other than browsing the web and using streaming services. And I'm here to tell you that that is absolutely not the case. I've run multiple different things simultaneously, including rendering 4K videos on Final Cut Pro, and I haven't run into any issues yet. Now that's not to say at some point you won't push it to the limit with longer renders or multiple renders at once. But this is an entry-level MacBook that's perfect for getting you started in the Apple ecosystem. But the M2 MacBook Air isn't just about raw performance. It also comes with a stunning retina display, which means that you'll be able to enjoy your favorite movies, TV shows, and games in stunning high definition with a max brightness of 500 nits. You can create captivating images and animations with the 10-core GPU and work with more streams of 4K and 8K ProRes videos with the high-performance media engine. This laptop also has a thin and lightweight design, making it easy to take with you wherever you go. This generation MacBook Air is strikingly thin at less than half an inch thick and made from 100% recycled aluminum. It's super lightweight at 2.7 pounds, letting you work, play, create just about anything from anywhere. I'm constantly on the go and rarely do I think about leaving it behind. Even if I don't plan on using it, I throw it in my backpack and I don't even notice it's there. And once you get home and you still have some work to do or you just want to play around with your MacBook, but you just wish you had a larger screen, well, it does support one external monitor creating an even more immersive experience. Now, let's talk about why the M2 MacBook Air might be the perfect way to spend some of your tax return money. If you're already in the market for a new laptop, the M2 MacBook Air offers excellent value for the money. Its powerful specs and sleek design make it a great choice for both work and play and it's likely to hold its value well over time. Plus, if you already have an iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch, this will be the perfect companion computer as you will enjoy some of the comforts of the Apple ecosystem, such as being able to make and receive FaceTime calls with the new and improved 1080p HD camera, have your Apple Music library instantaneously imported, and have all your photos and documents from your phone readily available. You can pick this up in four different beautiful colors, the normal space gray and silver, and new to this year, Starlight and Midnight. And I do feel it's important to mention that if you go with the Midnight color like I have, that this thing is an absolute fingerprint magnet. Hence why I have this cool looking skin on the front. And I'll make sure to leave a link in the description below where you can pick one of these up yourself. But even if you're not in the market for a new laptop, the M2 MacBook Air could still be a smart investment. With many of us working and studying from home, having a reliable and powerful laptop has never been more important. 
the M2 MacBook Air could help you be more productive and efficient, which could ultimately lead to more career opportunities or even higher grades if you're still in school. And additionally, this year we did see the M1 MacBook Air stay in Apple's lineup, so it is a safe assumption to assume that the M2 MacBook Air might be in the lineup for years to come. So if you're wondering what to do with your tax return, consider taking a portion of that money and investing in the M2 MacBook Air. And for just $1,200, its powerful specs, beautiful design, and long-term value make it a great choice for anyone looking to upgrade their computing experience. Thanks for watching. See ya.